<laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody. Or, should I say, I hope you had a good Christmas. It's Christmas Day here, but it won't be up till Saturday, won't the video. It looks flat. It is. It's Pepsi Max. It's not flat, but it's still a bit early in the day. Been waiting to open this for months. Sent by Skid Baxter. Thank you very much. And he said it's an early Christmas present. He said I don't have to open it on Christmas Day, but around about Christmas. So I'm opening it today. No idea what it's what's in it. He said it's not homebrew related. It's certainly not a bottle of beer. Alright, so let's have a look what's in here. Just check, make sure there's nothing else in the envelope. Nope, can discard the envelope, nothing else in it. Alright. Technically, I'm thinking it is. Alright, there's a there's a little note on the on the on the back, but we'll take that off. Hopefully I didn't show that. I'll have to blur it out if I did. Up, so technically it is home brewing because obtain your brewing equipment, brewing ingredients and equipment from Loftus. Established over a century. Illustrated price list on request. Tottenham Court Ward, uh, Tottenham Court Road, London W1. Telephone number. I'm suggesting this is. Not an antique, but you know what I mean. Historic. Oh, <laughs> I spotted it by CJJ Berry. If anyone's watched enough of my videos, you know that one of the main books that I go to is the first one that I originally bought. When was that? 40 years ago, perhaps. When I first started brewing, and it was 100 Beers and Stouts by C.J.J. Berry. So here we go. Look at that. How cool is this? Oh, look at that. I'm going to have to read this off offline, obviously. But it's got, oh yeah, it's got brewing vocabulary. Got recipes in there. Four gallons of water, four pounds of malt, six pounds, that's English pounds, six pounds of sugar. My God. That's going to be strong. Pale ale, six ounces of hops. What does it say? L1, L. Do -do 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 -do. Don't say what ABV, but six pounds of sugar. That's like. Just less than three kilos. Three kilos of sugar. With four pounds of malt as well. It doesn't say anything about it. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. This is a very strong pale ale. And it's best made by those living in the hard water district. Uh, it doesn't. I can't see an ABV on that one. I don't think I'll be making that one. But yeah, it, it's very similar. It has some of the same pictures in from his book. There he is, CJJ Berry. Probably dead years and years ago. As I say, I bought it 40 years ago. And he looks like he's in his 50s, at least there. So... It's going to be, and it was published before that, so I'm, I'm suspecting that he's no longer with us. Correct me if I'm wrong. About this book, April 3rd, 1963. 
so it was uh, no, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure about that anyway I'm going to read that at my leisure right thank you very much right see you next time have a hope you had a very happy Christmas very merry Christmas and here's to a very happy new year everybody cheers like and subscribe see you next time cheers bye